into the world of energy. This is the reception center. And the artwork that you see featured here today and through the month was done by the employees. Here you see a topographical map of the lake and the facilities. See those little red buttons? If you push on one of the buttons on the control panel, the light lights up and it explains just what you're seeing. Young people aren't left out. Much of this exhibit is devoted to the younger crowd. And quite well done. Your first test is becoming a full-fledged member of the Wattage Watchdog team with the shield or stuff when it comes to saving energy. Now that was the program on one of three small kiosks here, obviously intended for children. Notice the stools in front, so even the little ones get a chance to look. And look here, all sorts of tools from yesteryear displayed for us to see and marvel at. Probably something a little more modern now, but that's what they were working with. Here's some more electricity-related memorabilia. Look at these pieces. You're not going to find them just anywhere. The museum maintains a butterfly museum outside, sort of a little subsidiary, I guess. Here is information about that facility. We'll have to go take a look at that. was quite a visit. Here you see the entrance, which now, for me at least, has become the exit. A nice visit to the world of energy, sponsored by Duke Power.